Hey everybody, what's up? It's Nick here, and in this video I'm going to show you an application for the Mac that keeps your Mac clean and running healthy and can free up a lot of space that you're not using. The application is called Clean My Mac, and it does exactly what the name tells you. It cleans your Mac out of any unused files or any files that you do not need that could be slowing your Mac down. And so anyway, uh, Clean My Mac is not a free application, but uh, it freed me up a lot of memory space, and so uh, let's go ahead and show you guys the website on where to download it. So here's the website right here, which is macpaul.com slash index, and here as you see here is Clean My Mac. And so it's not a free program, as I said before, but you can go ahead and download a free trial of it here. If I go here to the store, you can go ahead and buy Clean My Mac for six months for $14.95, or you can go ahead and buy it for a lifetime for $30. So it's actually a pretty good application. So uh, that's where you can get it. I'll post a link to it in the description. So let's go ahead and show you guys the application right down here. So Clean My Mac is right down here, and as you notice, it comes up to this uh, really simple looking window right here. And over here it says, Welcome, keep your Mac clean and healthy. It was last scanned today, but I recovered zero kilobytes because I hit scan by mistake. And uh, I've totally removed three gigabytes of space. I have version 1.9.1, and I just registered to me, and uh, late, last update on is never. You can go ahead and tweet your results to your Twitter account once you've gone ahead and cleaned your Mac. Now over here on the side, as you notice, we have uh, one thing here for my Mac, and then below it we have caches, logs, language files, universal binaries, system junk, trashes and leftovers, and then uh, management extensions, uninstall applications, and quick erase files. So these are all the things that your Clean My Mac removes. Now what it does is it scans your Mac for anything that you do not need to use in these, such as uh, caches that you need to clean out, such as these, uh, system logs that you need to clean out, language files that you're not using, but I've completely cleaned out language files that I'm not using, and all of these other things. So anyway, uh, what you need to do to scan it is to go ahead and down here and click on scan, and it'll go ahead and scan your entire computer for anything that your computer does not need under all of these categories. And then once it's done scanning, you can go ahead over here and you can click remove to go ahead and remove anything that you do not need that your Clean My Mac found. So if we go up here to Preferences, as you notice here we're under the General tab. By default, it's enabled User Caches, iPod, Photo Caches, User Logs, Language Files, Universal Binary, System Junks, Trashes, and Leftovers. And here, over here, is you can choose which languages that you need to keep, which are the ones that are checkmarked. And so here under Devices, it has the uh, uh, what it does whenever you plug in devices, such as enable automatic trash cleanup, enable automatic macOS server junk cleanup, and enable automatic Windows server junk cleanup. Here we have the look for appearance, where you actually have the look between titanium and marble, but I like the titanium look. And then here are the advanced options right here to play sound, use secure files, some protected applications, and all of these other things right here. And under updates, you can just choose to go ahead and update it when you're done. And then that's pretty much clean my Mac. You just go ahead down here and click on scan. It'll go ahead and scan your Mac for anything that you're not using. And then you can go ahead and remove it. And it'll actually remove your Mac from that. Uh, it, not remove your Mac. It'll remove any files from your Mac that you don't need. And uh, once I did this and I deleted some files that I didn't need, it actually made my Mac run a little bit smoother and a little bit faster. So anyway, that is Clean My Mac. You can go ahead and find it here. I'll post the link in the description. So anyway, that is Clean My Mac. Thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video.